Hello traders and it's great to be back with you. This is Bill, tradingwithbill.com. Yes, we are back. We are starting a new video series. As you can see, we are looking to trade Forex and options. And I plan on giving you a video at least one a day, maybe two. And I got to be honest with you, I'm not spending a lot of time on editing. Well, let's be honest. I'm not going to spend no time on editing. Uh, if we make a mistake, we're just going to get through it. I'll tell you I made a mistake. We'll just keep on going. It's really great to be back um, back on YouTube and, and back on Twitter, putting out our videos daily. And remember, our, our purpose is education. And I'm just giving back what I was given over the last 10 years as a as a Forex uh, trader and for the last three years trading options and majorly in vertical spreads. So that's what's going on. It's great to be back. Let's take a look at this pound dollar today. Now we're in Asia when I'm recording this and look at this move that we've had to the upside. So what we're looking at here is we can see that price has moved up in the U.S. session. This is an hourly chart. So price moved up, went sideways, and then continued up to the upside at the open of, of Asia. And we can see now that price has gone above the 20, 1.2495 entry point and actually hit 2505 today, and um, but didn't close above the 25 level. And now we can see we have a red candle. And that's exactly what we're looking for. So I'm thinking maybe in the next hour or so, I'm looking to sell this at 24.90, 24.95, and we'll take this to the downside. And you know, we're gonna have some trouble here, right? You can see left of the chart here that we have some issues with um, price action, right? So we can see at the 50% bid, the 618, we're gonna get some price action hits over there. And then we were looking to take profit all the way back here at the, the 2430 area, we're looking to take some profits here. Um, I might scale out somewhere at this 38.2 zone because I think we're going to get a pretty good bounce out. I don't want to give all these profits back. However, remember our bias is bearish. We want to sell the pound dollar. We do not want to um, buy the pound, right? It's very weak. It's going to get weaker. So we just want to keep selling this as price gives us these um, up moves and we can sell it back off, right? We're bearish in the pound dollar. We want to buy the dollar. Yesterday was a great day, and I got to be honest with you, I missed the trade. Yesterday was a great sell-off in a, a lot of the um, dollar pass, and I even tweeted that the dollar index was above 101. And um, yeah, missed it. But, you know, something to keep an eye on today is what is the dollar index going to do today? However, this pound dollar trade looks like a really nice trade. Traders, thank you so much for being with me. And I got to be honest, I'm really excited to be back with you. We're going to be doing options also. So come visit me at tradingwithbill.com. You can always get a preview. Always go to my YouTube link. And of course, I'll be putting this on Twitter as well. So really excited to be back. And uh, we'll keep in touch. And we'll see you probably a little bit later today. Take care, traders. Have a great one. See you next time. Bye-bye.